going on, YouTube? I'm going to welcome back to the Pokemon Storm Silver. God damn it, Pokemon are sacred gold egg -lock. I don't know why I've been saying Storm Silver. That's really strange. Anyways, in the last episode, we made here to Blackthorn City. We got a couple encounters and pretty cool stuff. So as you see, I'll go over the team quickly. They got up a couple levels from battling and such, so... We have Pachi at level 49 with a quiet nature holding the leftovers. So Giga Drain, Sleep Powder, Petal Dance, Sludge Bomb. We have Packard here, the, the Fero, holding Sharp Beak, Adam and Nature, uh, Quick Attack, Drill Peck, Fame Attack, and Fly. Uh, we have Electivire here with a Calm Nature holding leftovers, uh, Crush Trap Strength, Ice Punch, and Discharge. We have Jose here with a, uh, a Naive Nature holding the leftovers, X Wizard Night Slash, Poison Thing, and Cut. We have Chuck here holding the Choice Band with a uh, Jolly Nature, uh, Close Combat, Fire Punch, Thunder Punch, Mock Punch, and finally, but definitely not the least, last but not least, excuse me, anyway, so we have Cedric the Artillery here holding the Choice Specs, Ice Beam, Surf Signal Beam, and Psy Beam. This thing is overpowered. Anyway, so as you saw, I got those Pokemon to hatch. So I did a little bit of looking around, and apparently sometimes the Quick Egg hatch codes in Dreano hacks just stop working. So I ended up going. I'll show you here. I'll go to my cheat list, and uh, I don't. I hope it shows. But as you see here, I was able to go to this cheats database thing, and it says checksums not matching. But I was able to go down here, and I don't remember exactly where it is, but it, there's a specific thing to. Yeah, here we go. Fast egg hatch. So one step equals 255. And uh, that made it work. So that was pretty good stuff. I tried both of them. The other one crashed the game, so it was weird. Anyways, uh, yeah. So we ended up hatching a Spoink, a uh, an Oddish, and what uh, was it? Yeah, that. Whatever. Uh, Shinx. That's I couldn't remember the name of that. Anyway, yeah. So let's check him out. He's got some dope ass moves. Thunder Fang, Ice Fang, Nice Slash, Fire Fang. So and he can poke us. So I guarantee he'll be taking the spot. Of kitty of kitty pray that doesn't go down so anyway also I love to use freaking radish because I remember I used one in the uh, the what the X wonder wedlock I don't remember if I died against Clint if that was his name Clive the the, the freaking electric type kid at prison tower anyway he like killed three of my Pokemon my Greninja survived for a while after that so it, I mean, it wasn't. I don't know if Radish was the one who fell or not. Anyway, point being that I love to use this thing again. So if Venusaur goes down. Uh, this thing's gonna be on the squad. So learn Drain Punch when it evolves. Uh, it's got Razor Leaf and Mega Drain too. Pretty cool and and, and Sleep Powder. So hopefully it'll learn a Poison type move. Uh, I'm going to be keeping it a Gloom until 40. Eight or somewhere around there. I don't remember exactly what the level was, but it learns Giga Drain then, and I'd like to have Giga Drain. So, anyways, we're gonna think on Claire today because we're gonna be able to get at least one more encounter today. We may end up taking on Ho-Oh. We'll see what happens here. Yo, trainer, whatever. They're weak against ice types. I know. I don't know why I'm doing this voice. I'm gonna put Chuck up front because I feel that Chuck could do more. I mean, Sludge Bomb from Venusaur would not feel too nice anyway, so you know. Anyway, let's do this. First battle against Dragon Ball Street. It's how they are. I'm pretty sure if we were this close to lava, it'd cook us. Alright, it's simple enough. Uh, Seedra, I'd like to switch. Probably. I just don't think Mach Punch will do enough. You never know what this thing could have. This is dead anyway, so who cares? I don't want to st I didn't mean to stand, but it's okay, because Pudge killed it. Woo! Good job, Pudge. I was down what you could do against dragons, but you know, you definitely showed me you can do a lot against dragons. <laughs> Squames. It's close combat. Yeah. Goodbye. Oh, code. Oh, code. Alright, next up is like a bite. Oh, let's go, kitty, because I have ice punch. Boom. Goodbye. Ace Trainer Lola has a bit uh, defeated. So I was thinking about it, and I should probably use a PP up here on close combat, because that could be useful. I could use both of them in close combat because I don't have any five PowerPoint moves on anyone else. Except for uh, Cross Chop, but I already use a PP Max on that. There we go. What's up, dude? It's not how use Dragon types. We're only interested in strong Pokemon. Well, you gotta use Dragon types. That's in the gym! <laughs> or whatever. That was not what I meant to say, but it works. I didn't mean to quick attack, but I'll just fly on you. Oh, you're gonna D dance! Okay, it's a good thing I have quick attack. <laughs> Ooh, that could have been bad. What's up? 
I've been training hard with Claire. Sure. Whatever you say. I'm so sorry, Flygon. I love you. You ain't no match for my, uh, my beautiful, super fast Infernape, though. So, not much, not much I can say about that. Goodbye. Why do you all have one Pokemon? How does that help you? You're a gym trainer. You should be having more Pokemon than that. There we go. What's up, Claire? Oh, I want to check. Do I have any... I have four Ethers, so I'm going to use one. Well, up Chuck's close combat so I don't have to go back and uh, heal. Because I don't want to... This is one of my favorite gyms in all of Pokemon. Because Dragon Typing is just a cool... I, I mean, Claire is an irritating trainer, but her gym is dope. I am Claire, the world's best Dragon Titan master. I am Gaia. I get on my own against the Pokemon Link's Elite Four. Do you still want to take me on? <sighs> Whatever, let's do this. Let's dream that I use my full power against my opponent. Any opponent. Let's do it! Dragonair. Alright. I'm really glad I didn't have to do any grinding. This should okay. I mean, it's Iron Fist choice band stab from the infernape and it's close combat after all all right fall through the floor there we go chucks up to level 50 next up is a guy Arados. okay i want to switch into kitty kitty get out here oh no you intimidate me i mean we i'm gonna use a discharge and a goodbye you ain't living that do we have a magnet I have leftovers on Kitty anyway, so never mind. I didn't need the crit. It would have killed no matter what. I guarantee it. Four times super effective from an Electivire. Which is special attack is only a little bit lower than its attack right now. Mm. Next up is another Dragonair. I am not choiced in, so I can actually hit you with an Ice Punch. Because I was thinking I was choiced, but I can just Ice Punch you in the face. And do a lot of damage. May one shot. Because... Oh, no, not even close. Outrage! That hurts! And that was also English. Wow! Um... Okay! What's my most offensive Pokémon? Is it Jose? 127? Yeah, it's definitely Drapion. Okay. Jose, get in here! I need you to live in Outrage. Yeah, he lives out really nicely. Okay. I'm Night Slash. I'm really glad I have a Drapion. It's got a great typing and it's great in defense right now. That's fine. You're going to Hyper Potion. Uh, I'm also Hyper Potion right now. Why? Well, I'm, I'm going to hope you get hit by Confusion. You don't. You Dragon Pulse me. Okay. I'm a Poison Fang. Ow! There we go. Alright. Good job, team. We did it. Our next up is a Salamence. Um... You know, no playing around. Get out here, Ho Celeste. Cedric. Sorry. I might look up a gen- Like, if I can change the gender of Cedric. Just to make it female so it can be Celeste. I mean, it wouldn't- It literally would change nothing except for- That I can name it. Okay, that's gonna hurt. But I- I have faith in artillery. But, it would change nothing except for the fact that I just- I would now have a- Female artillery. All right, you're good. You're gone. I'm sorry. Your special defense was low. Was raised back by the waiter, but ice be specs ice beam. No way. Goodbye. Good job, Cedric. Proud of you. Next up is an Altaria. I can send in Packard. I think pretty, uh, pretty okay. Just because I want to like get everyone up to level 50. So I like to have an even, even team. It just makes me feel good. <laughs> I don't know. Alright, anyway. Let's do a decent amount of damage to you. Holy... Oh, gosh. I legit forgot I got Ice Beam. Packard, no. Packard! Thank you. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my God. Now you Dragon Pulse. Really? Alright, Thunder Punch should kill. Yeah, because Chuck's a beast. Next up is Kingdra. Alright. Perfect that I have Pudge. Pudge, I need you to handle it. 
<laughs> Kingra's an issue. Kingra's always an issue. I can put it to sleep, hopefully. One Pokemon, that is where the real battle begins. Sure, whatever you say. Yes, Mr. Blizzard, come on. Yes! Haha, <laughs> punch! My boy! Let's do it! You're supposed to win? Nah. Yes! Punch! I was so worried there because uh, you hit the blizzard, but they didn't do as much as I thought it would, in all honesty. Budge, you're the man! I lost? I don't blame this. It makes some mistake. Which is funny because I knocked out all of your Pokemon, but I still don't get the badge. I won't concede this. I might have lost. You're still not ready for the league. Uh-huh. If you can t hold your own, then I can too. You're a bitch! I hate you, Claire! You're a sore loser! You're just a stupid sore loser. I don't understand that. It's still, it's funny, because like in this generation, in this, yeah, in this generation, this region, you have two sore loser gym leaders, being Whitney and, um, Claire. So, anyway, that battle went swimmingly well. It could have gone better, but you know, it's okay, because it ended up going pretty well. What do you have to say, Jose? Intently at the mountain. All right. So is the ice cave a mountain? The ice path. Well, so we get an encounter here in the Dragon's Den. And then, uh, we'll be going toward the Bell Tower today. Most likely. Not most likely, we will. I guarantee it. You know, you dare enter uninvited. No, I was kind of forced to go here. Because you're stupid gym leader. Ha! Pathetic! Jose's a beast. He's literally a wall. I love this Pokemon. I love Drapion. Drapion's always been such a dope Pokemon. A revive! Wordless! What's this? Them bones, them bones, the calcium. I don't even know, dude. What's up? You shouldn't be in here. Okay. Neither should you. Especially with that kind of pathetic of a Pokemon. Go! Oh my goodness, go up. Packard, get out here. Ha! 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 Alright, get out here, Jose. And a crit. And a goodbye. Ow. Alright, I'll just keep doing that. We're good. Sweet! We did it! Woo! I mean, Jose's running through everybody. I love I love Drapion so much. Like, I legitimately love Drapion. It's an awesome Pokemon. I need a Whirlpoolmon! And no! I have Ice Beam, but I really don't want to get rid of that. Okay. Wow, Jose is faster than Packard. What? Alright, I'm gonna heal up Jose. The robber's down. You're gonna D-dance. Oh no! Hey, that does not that good. Alright, quick attack. Hey! Wow! You are super slow if one D-dance and you couldn't have speed my Drapion. Jose goes level 50. Aw oh, yeah! Jose, you the bomb. Good job, Packard. Actually, you like, super clutched that. Max Elixir. Very nice. Alright, time to go get a Whirlpoolmon. I mean, literally, only Cedric can learn Whirlpool. Well, that's exactly why I don't want to teach him that, because I don't have... I have an Ice Beam team, but I don't really want to use it on Cedric, because he learned it by level up. So, you know. I suppose I could always go to the move relearner, but nah. I don't have to fight any more trainers, I don't think. And we'll have Fion be our... A quote-unquote HM slave, even though I hate saying that. I feel bad for this thing, it has all water moves. Bubble, Whirlpool, Waterfall, and Surf. Strength's a good move, and Cut's a good move. Whirlpool is still bad. For like, for my kind of way, it's bad. And I'm thinking about it, if I remember correctly, I believe in, that Drayano put that you get like a Dratini from these guys, like after you come, if you come back after you, uh, Pass the test and whatnot, and get your, get the TM and stuff. Hey, a dragon thing! That is so cool. That that was the actual test back in the originals was to get that dragon thing, and they have it in the same place. Just this time, we have to take a test to prove our metal. And because Claire can't pass the test because she thinks only winning is important. Good to see you, Han. Let me explain why you came crash at you. That goes a handful. I'm sorry, I must test you. Not to wait until only a few questions, really. What a Pokemon to you, your allies. Understand what helps you to win battles. Strategy. Understand. What kind of trainer do you wish to battle? 
Anybody. I understand what is most important for raising Pokemon. Love. I understand strong Pokemon, which is more important. Um, strength, obviously. Didn't quite catch that. What was it you said? Strong Pokemon, weak Pokemon. Okay. So, apparently strength, you won't let me say that. Whatever. So, how did it go? Guess there's no point asking. You did fail? What, you passed? That can't be! You're lying. Even I haven't been approved. Glad! This show is impeccable and still in spread. Meant to fit and confirm the rising badge. Must have formed lots of this. Um, I understand. Here, take this rising badge. Hurry up, take it. Nani? We get the rising badge from Claire! Thank you. Pretty much to enable your Pokemon to use move climbing waterfalls. Let's Pokemon know you straight and obey every command without question. Claire, reflect upon what it is you lack in this child house. Thanks. But if you're not Luke yet, Pokemon City don't want to rise. It might just mad words of the old. Well, who cares, actually? I don't remember. You can get you get a Dratini from these guys. That's all I remember. I have to figure out how. I think... I don't remember if you come... I, I think you actually have to get a TM from... Or get the call from Elm or something like that. Because the Kimono Girls want to meet us. Oh, we have to battle the Kimono Girls today. I forgot about that. Oh, Clay, you're going to give me Dragon Pulse. Wait, I'm sorry about this. Take this as my apology. Team 59, Dragon Pulse. Thanks. What's your matter? You headed to our new back town? Come on. Yeah, it's face. Don't you dare give up. Give it your all and I'll give you my number. The time will all prevail or something like that. You're welcome! You just phased through the wall. Okay. Maybe that was the fault of the speed up or just some sort of glitch. Anyway. Uh, uh, hey, Zarkel. Oh, well, how's it going? I got all some neat. Let's make up my lab pick it up. See you later. It's the Master Ball. Which I'm pro I might use... We'll see, I might actually try to catch Ho-Oh with, like, actual Pokeballs, and then, uh, see if I can save the Master Ball and catch one of the Roaming Legends, so I get another encounter again. <laughs> because I'm deb- I'm determined to get one. I'm not gonna actually do that for Entei, I'll try to do it on Raikou. I put Raikou to sleep, but I haven't damaged Raikou yet. Oh, hey, Professor, oh my god, I am coming to get the Master Ball. Oh my gosh, I haven't done her voice in forever. Zombie, you trying to collect these badges? That's so cool! This is way for you! I thought I'd never see some badges. Thank you, my reason are going great. Thanks for talking my appreciation. Thank you for the Master Ball, sir. Mm, yes. Make the battle the best. It's all the Pokeball. Catch a Pokeball that fits. Give it on no to research. Think you can make a better use of it than I can. By the way, we just heard a group of come out of here looking for you. Sakya, so people are talking about you! Aren't you a Kimono Girls? You better have those people! You made me proud to be your friend! Bye, Lyra. Well, I guess I'll wait for you at the Ecrity Dance Theater. Oh, I knew that face, man. Maybe it's after I catch the legendary Pokemon. We'll go to Ecrity for now. Okay, I don't remember uh, what it leads with. It's it, I'm pretty sure they lead with whichever is first in the decks. And my guess is that might be Flareon, because if we. No. Moltres is the last one. So it's probably Jolteon. Because Vaporeon is the last in the decks. I know that for sure. One undoubtedly Cedric. Or Chuck, excuse me. Oh. How, how is this possible? I'm gonna lose the American Mono Girls. You're watching me. That's right. I never thought defeating some Mono seven Kimono Girls would be so hard. Got beaten to a pulp. Must have come in with the same reason. Don't get cocky just because you beat a Team Rocket. Kimono Girls are insanely strong. Go ahead, see if you can defeat them. I'm not going back. I don't want to see you win. Okay. Hello, Kamana Girls. Welcome, my name is Ozuki. I met you previously in Violet City. Not to bring back a hall, we need someone to write bond with the Pokemon. We have missed the Pokemon to give Misty Egg to whoever should prove true potential. It was eventually handed from Mr. Pokemon to Professor Elm and to you. I will be in pure love when I see you fish in the pit flower the Pokemon. I must just test you. Are you ready? Let's do it. I don't remember. Actually, are you Umbreon? I would just so close to you bonded with your Pokemon. I don't remember who's first. Pokemon. Alright, let's see who you have uh, first. Oh no! I'm so sorry, Casper! I'll put you out of your misery quick! Alright, we're done. I remember Nappy so, so mad at the Umbreon that he just let his Torterra die. 
You are quite a strong yummy Narvix force. My name is Naoko. I'm the one who's not so good at directions. My eyes will see you feed the team market when covers in Tower Swap or Quack. I may have challenge you in your Pokemon. Sure. Um, my guess is this will be Espeon then? Indeed. Alright, get out here, Jose. Nice lash. Wow, you survived. Surprising. Alright, goodbye. Jose is so fast and he's also bulky. Oh, you're pretty strong. I don't- I wasn't even paying attention to your levels, I think they're all level 50. You're a formidable trainer, my name is Izumi, we have not met the previous year that I'm more competitive to show me your strength. Oh yeah, the two that we haven't met are the two that have the newer evolutions, being uh, Glaceon and Leafeon, so. Hello oh, Leafeon, best cry in the game. Sorry. Chuck, you're too good! <laughs> Chuck's rutted house on these guys. Impressive indeed, this is our first meeting as well. I meet the Komono girl and I may trust you as well. I just realized, did I ever, did I catch my encounter of the dragons then? I don't think so. Oh well, I didn't mean to use close combat, I was planning on using mock punch, but it's okay. Goodbye. I'm gonna get encountered just because I want to hatch Pokemon anyway. It doesn't matter. I probably won't end up using it. I want to end up using most of the Pokemon I hatched in Johto because I'm gonna like basically just segment them off and then when I hatch new ones for Kanto, those will be the ones I can use in Kanto. You're quite a trainer. I remember you chasing off Team Rocket Gun from right here, but thank you for that. Although I'm just a trainer myself, she knows the most speaks at least. I am Miki. Oh, come on, I got a limited challenge on your Pokemon. Pokemon. The next three we have. We have the other three, the original three. Flareon. Flareon looks strange in this game. Wow. Alright, goodbye. Who's next? Excellent to fighting a spear to come here to Ike by pushing me from the back. I'm not one of those and sandals. I am still. Hey, come on, go see the dragon when you press the test of the elder. Let me challenge you and your Pokemon. Alright. You have Jolteon. Alright. Bye. <laughs> Chuck, you're too good. She said I almost had you. No, you didn't. You didn't do a lick of damage. I am the last one. You so depend on the going right tonight. No one who was even underground. I am cooling the commander. I looked you in wonder when you throw out a team up mission. Let's take over the radio tower. You must show your strength to me now. Let me turn Junior Pokemon. Alright, you get to battle a Pokemon that I don't think was around for that. Pedal Dance! Wow. Bye bye. We did it! Woo! Punch or Chuck nearly got the level 52. Oh, you are wonderful. Thanks. I like how they have the, the white makeup on their faces. Do they actually? Or is that just like the way they sprite them and that the light just looks like that? Because thinking like, because you've seen Kimono Girls, they, they would paint their face with this white chalk paint. I mean, at least that's how it's been depicted. I don't know! I mean, not the one you indeed worthy of this piece ticket. We got the clear bell. That was bad. Oh, it's okay. We will beat the bell. How about see you there? Bye. You ready to do this, dude? Chuck danced a wonderful dance. Proud of you, buddy. <laughs> Cedric stance. Nice job, buddy. You have his most fortune. I have something for you. Take this dragon air. It's a dragon air and not a not a Dratini. All right. Forgot about that. No. Dragon Pokemon Sabal Ever Clan. You something. It's level 45. Modest nature with a Draco play. Nice. Sweet. Well, that's a level 45 encounter for us. So for this, I'm going to be b borrowing Taco. Mainly because he has Thunder Wave, and I'd like to be able to catch the Ho-Oh in non- and not a Master Ball. Alrighty, Bell Tower. The thing you have! The Rainbow Wing, yeah. You've done it, please come through. Okay. Alright, here we go. Prime Counter is a Golbat. 
Alright, there we go. Got it. I'll take whatever you have, Packard. He gave me the white beard. <laughs> okay. With all these items my Pokemon find, it's like they want to get dressed up or something. Wait, wait. There we go. That was weird. I was jumping there and it's like, no. And it's just like, wait, what? This is where I'm supposed to go. Oh no, I missed the item. I actually want to go back and get it. Dang it, I missed it again. At least I got this item. An escape rope. Uh, it's an ultra ball. Alright. I get the one back that I used on the gold bat who didn't want to stay in it. I also think I'm supposed to go up this one. I don't remember the order. So I guess we'll just see. I'll experiment until I get lucky. Or I figure it out. Well. What does this lead me to? Is this the right way? I can get the item if I go this way. It's a full heal. I mean, not like I didn't already have enough of those. Okay. I want to go back, actually, because I want to be able to... Yeah. That's what I thought. Okay. So I was right going this way. I'm going to get that item, though. Rare candy! I actually have to use... Well, actually, it's going to go into the, the medicine pouch anyway. I'm just going to use it, though. Here you go. Taco's not alive, though. By the way, guys, I'm just borrowing him. Just because I thought Electivire learned Thunderwave, but apparently he didn't. Though I distinctly know, remember him having it. I didn't ever use it, but I know he had it. Maybe it was I taught him the TM or something. No, I think I taught the team to Jolteon. Alright, it's kind of funny how my first attempt I got it right. I don't know. I mean, just, I've never had an easy time with this puzzle. Where does this take me? Alright, uh, a panel with two warp. Alright, this just takes me to an item I can do with that. It's a max elixir. Shoot, I forgot to take the... <laughs> God damn it. There we go. Okay, what is this gonna be? It's another item. It's a nugget. Okay. Okay. So neither of these were the right way. So I gotta go back through here. And I gotta go here. I max survive. Worthless. Oh no, I did it again. Oh god darn it. I mean, it's not even a big deal. I just do this. It's an item. That's an HP up. This will lead me to this item. Yes. A full restore. Nice. Seems to be that tiny bit of money that I definitely need. Because it's not like I sold so many full full heals that I have plenty. Alright, there we go. We made it to ho -Oh. Yay. We can see one of the best cutscenes in the game. Actually, I'll get, I get the chance. I don't want to have Taco up front. Okay, he's not even out front. Yes, this is what we welcome a ho -oh. When the dance back to the Manetas comes on to the sound of the clip, we entrusted Hosh to come down for great arches in the sky again. Oh's animation is so much better than Lugia's. Look at that, dude. Lugia's just busted the waterfall and freezes in place. But that looks so dope. That is indeed a horror, the Guardian of Skyrim from ancient times. Many have tried only to fail. 
Doc and your heart in the creep and how many you finally made it appear. Doc and don't you see how much of it's a waiting for you at this time, would you agree? I guess so. Ready, ho? Also love Ho's theme. Better than Lydia's. Sweet. So we're gonna I'm just gonna Thunder Wave it. I'm a quick attack at a bunch and I want it to take me out. Yeah, that's exactly what I wanted it to do because Taco's technically dead anyway. Alrighty! I'm gonna send out Cedric. Even though I'm Specs, Ice Beam should not kill. Oh, easily you won't. Okay. I need you to not do that and get paralyzed. Alright, let's go for a... Man, now it's kind of... I wish I changed the time back to night before I actually went and caught the thing. I was gonna say you're fast, but my... Cedric outspeeds you. So let's go for an Ultra Ball and see what happens. Not even close. And you get the burn. Okay, so that was pointless. She just thrown a Pokeball. That's not true. I'm glad I did what I did. Because I just like to, like, not use the... I should have gone for a Quick Ball turn one. I forgot about that. Okay. We can go for a Fast Ball. Alright, you're going to Sunny Day me. Do I have Cedric? Not Cedric. I... The one po... Well, I guess he was a... I don't want to risk it. Cedric is my best Pokemon to have out here. And if things get too dire, I will just throw the Master Ball at it. I just like you to, like... Okay, you missed a Fire Blast. Good. Alright, so let's go for a... Let's go for a Heavy Ball, because I'm pretty sure you're probably pretty heavy. Damn it, man! I don't know, this may be just, like, a lost cause to try to catch this thing. With... And not in a Master Ball. We'll try another heavy ball. Alright, you know what? I wanted to save the master ball, but I can't. I just need I need to catch it, so. Thanks, Ho. -Oh. Give a nickname. Uh what did I wanna what a pest. I wanna name you pest. Cause you wouldn't get caught in an orange Pokeball. <laughs> Be disappointing, I had to use my Master Ball, but, you know. Alright, I'm sorry, Taco. Thank you. Thank you for helping me out today. Alrighty, so here are the three encounters we have. So we have... Some pretty good, uh... Stuff to use, so that'll be nice. I'm glad I used the Master Ball when I did, because each of these moves have only five power points, so it could've killed itself with Struggle, which would've sucked. Anyways, um, we're going to be swapping out some very high-level Pokemon, so we're gonna have... Some Pokemon who are very apt to be on deck if perhaps some of our team dies on the way to the, the Pokemon League or whatever. So, I uh, continue box operations. Yeah, I didn't mean to do what I did because I'm whatever. Anyway, that I don't even know what I'm saying, but let us search up the random number generator. 30 is the first egg we get. All right, all right. It's got a, a lucky egg. Alright, that'll be swapped out for a little 45 dragon air. I didn't end up getting the encounter in the dragon's den because I forgot to get it, so you know. Uh, I'm not gonna. Okay, I clicked the button, it went literally next one 29, 28. That's not random. Come on, that's just. It's just in orderly fashion. But the next one is 17, so. I gotta click. What the hey? I suck when that happens. What? I don't know. Anyway, we have Rubik's here. I don't know what you'll be, but I guess we'll find out. And number 21. 19, 19, 20, 21. Oh, shoot. Long box. Okay. No, I'm gonna I'm re-randomize the number. This time I got six. Okay. Polar Knight. Polar Knight question mark? With a hey, never melt ice. Alright, so let's get these items. 45, 43, and 50. 
One of them will literally be on par with the squad. What are you gonna be? Uh, that's a dupes. Yeah, okay, you were that first guy, so I'll, I'll get you exchanged. I'm gonna end up hashing the Rubik's, dude. Anyway, what are you gonna be, Rubik's? Porygon, that makes sense! But I'm going to have to rename you to Air 404. Sorry. Sorry, not sorry. And I can get it all the way up to a Porygon Z if I wanted to. Because there's no Eevee Light, so it'll be better than, you know. Anyway. We'll check out our Rubik's here after I ex get another egg from here, which is egg 25. In place of little swine up here. Your impish with Icicle Spear. You had Icicle... Well, no, never mind. I was thinking Icicle Crash. Icicle Crash didn't exist in this game. You had a good moveset, so it sucks that I already have one. So you have Modest with Conversion Sharp and Tackle and Conversion 2. So a, a default moveset, but Modest and Download. So that's really nice. Alright, so this is this should be the number the level 43 egg. No, the level 45 egg. Because Porygon's a level 43. This is why I got the Covenant Orb. Because now we can have a Gengar. Alright, what do I name you? You are male. What do I name a male Gengar? Is it Kage? I believe Kage is Shadow in Japanese. I don't know, that's what Jen always named his uh Darkrai, and I'm pretty sure it means Shadow, so it works. Anyway, Kage here the get the ghastly quiet nature, which is meh, but you know, Will Wisp pays Side Wave and Thunder Punch. Not bad. All right, and the final Pokemon. This will be the level 50. What's gonna be the level 50? I'm excited to find out because this thing is gonna be literally on par. Why did it have to be an Eevee? I will see. We'll see if I keep it, because it depends what it's definitely supposed to be. You're modest with adaptability. I'm gonna. I'm gonna exchange you, because I've already had a Jolteon. I mean, Espeon would be the next best thing, but I don't really want to do that. All right, next number, 24. All right, that works. I mean, you were you were definitely a decent Pokemon. There's no saying that. Or no saying you're not. But anyways, this is the level 45 uh, one. Or, no, excuse me, level 50. It's still level 50. Oh man, it's a Diglett! Oh, man, I remember when I would always play yellow, I'd go and I'd run around until I found that, the, Doug, the level 30 Doug Trio. You are modest nature too. That's just insult to injury, bro. Rock slide, astonish, reversal, and pursuit. I'm not gonna lie, you're most likely never gonna be used. I'm sorry, little guy. I'm not gonna do anything because I'm going to level them up before we end off the episode. So I really have enjoyed our one before I stop why before I close out of the emulator and stuff. So I really hope you enjoyed this episode, guys. If you did, I'll like push you in the next episode we'll be taking on I uh, will be heading up to uh Victory Road, most likely. So pretty cool stuff. Thanks for watching. I'll talk to you later. Wait.